Welcome to Sometime One. Today we're working with page 14. Let's start with the first box. How many animals can you see? One, two, three, four, five, six. Do they all have four legs? Hmm, not really. Do they all have tails? Mm, not really. Well, I'm not sure about the octopus. Are you? Does an octopus have a tail or just legs? Octopus legs are called tentacles. Octopuses use their tentacles for holding, grasping, feeling and moving. So. I'm not sure whether they are arms or legs. Maybe they're both. You spell tentacles like this. T-E-N-T-A-C-L-E-S. Tentacles. Do all the animals in box number one live in the sea? Mm-mm. How many of them live in the sea? Which ones live in the sea? Well, we have the whale, we have the shark, we have the octopus. So we have a subset of three. Three of the animals live in the sea. Do all the animals live on land? How many of them live on land? Which ones live on land? Well, the lion lives on the land, the tiger lives on the land, the goat lives on the land, or on land. Do they all eat meat? Hmm, I'm not sure. How many of them eat meat? Which ones eat meat? I suppose the tiger does. I suppose the lion does. I suppose the shark does too. Do they all eat fish or plants? How many of them eat fish or plants? Which ones eat fish or plants? Are they all dangerous? How many of them are dangerous? Which ones are dangerous? You think goats are dangerous? You think an octopus is dangerous. Which ones are good to eat? Have you ever eaten tiger meat? What about goat meat? Do you like goat meat? What about whale meat or shark? You see how much we can talk about in this box? You could even write a little story about the man who has jumped overboard. Why did he jump into the sea? How did the shark get into his boat? What happens next? Well, yes, we can do all that, but we're supposed to be talking about subsets. So in box number one, we have a set of six animals, perhaps seven if you count the fisherman as an animal, now, of these seven animals, how many live in water? There's the shark, the whale, the octopus. That's all. So we have a subset of three animals that live in the sea. And we have a subset of animals that live on land. How many animals are there in that set? Well, that's the way to work with this page. Talk to you again soon.